The ongoing eruption at the summit of Kilauea remains paused following the end of episode 15, and scientists report the current situation appears substantially different compared to previous breaks in activity. Episode 15 featured lava fountains over 1,000 feet high or 305 meters. The tallest of the entire eruption. The episode ended abruptly on the evening of March 26th after erupting for just over 31 hours. The USGS Hawaiian Volcano Observatory published video of the towering fountains and photos showing the aftermath. The tephra from the fountains filled a gully located about 140 yards west of the crater rim and partially buried this tree. Two cameras and a laser rangefinder were knocked offline by the vigorous activity. Volcanic gas and debris filled the air of the surrounding area, and the material even covered one of the active vents in the crater. While the current pause has followed the same pattern of reinflation, the observatory reports some notable differences. For one, a few hours following the end of episode 15, about a dozen small earthquakes occurred near the summit. There was also a significant drop in seismic tremor. Additionally, the glow seen from the inactive vents is substantially less than what was observed after previous episodes. Scientists say the blocking of the vents could partially suppress degassing. The observatory says the continued inflation of the summit indicates that magma is being replenished at a rate similar to prior pauses and another episode is likely to take place if magma can overcome any blockage of the conduit. Current rates of inflation indicate that a new episode could begin between Monday, March 31st and Wednesday, April 2nd, if the conduit is reopened. However, if additional pressure is required to reopen the pathway, the window for an eruption restart could be delayed. Or scientists say, the eruption could end. For now, there is no indication of activity along the Kilauea rift zones, and the USGS volcano alert level remains at watch.